ask for death is the message the Palestinian Authority has been conveying to its children since the start of violence in October 2000. In July of 2002, two articulate 11-year-old girls were interviewed in the studio of official Palestinian television. What has caused this compelling desire for death among these children? The Palestinian Authority has been making a supreme effort to convince their own children that there is no greater achievement than to die for Allah in battle, known as Shahada. This indoctrination film clip is designed to offset a child's natural fear of death. It portrays Shahada as both heroic and tranquil and was broadcast repeatedly over the last two years. The film's hero, a nice looking schoolboy, leaves his father a farewell letter explaining his choice to carry out Shahada. <laughs> This film was broadcast on official Palestinian television. Most of the scenes portray blood and death. The film ends with this screen displaying in Arabic and in English, Ask for death, the life will be given to you. In another film clip, I am the Shaheed, my mother, mothers are urged to be joyous over the Shahada death of their own children. The Palestinian Authority's Ministry of Education textbooks portray Shahada as an ideal. For example, the poem of the Shaheed appears in textbooks on four grade levels and extols yearning for death. A song honoring Wafa Idris, the first woman suicide terrorist, was broadcast on Palestinian television three times. The Shahada mandate comes from top Palestinian political leadership. اللي بيمسك الحجر قدام الدبابه مش اكبر رساله للعالم وبيستشهد هذا البطل Palestinian Authority gives significant media exposure to parents who praise their children's choice to die الحمد لله رب العالمين برفع راسي وقلي الفخر والاعتزاز اللي ابني شهيد Palestinian religious leaders have been a driving force in calling for Palestinians to kill Jews especially through suicide bombings, and direct these messages at children as well. Palestinian polls show that 72 to 80 percent of Palestinian children desired death as shaheeds. Having been repeatedly exposed to this indoctrination, Palestinian children today actively set their sights on shahada as a personal goal.
يعني صح احنا بنحزن الشباب لما يموتوا بنحزن الاطفال لما يصير هيك بس لازم بنفس الوقت نفرح لانه الشهداء مصيرهم الجنة ايه ايات الاخرس لما فجرت يعني كان عمرها 17 سنة صابرين الان هل الوضع الطبيعي انه ايات الاخرس تفجر نفسها؟ ايه طبعا ايه وضع طبيعي The Palestinian indoctrination has already led to the death of Palestinian children. Young children have written farewell letters to their parents in which they express pride in their desire to die and have set out on suicide terrorist attacks. The child Yusuf Zakut wrote, Don't cry for me. Bury me with my brothers and with the Shaheeds. The Palestinian Authority has created a violent, death-seeking reality for their children having taught them to see death for Allah, Shahada, as an ideal which they are expected to achieve. The examples presented in this report are a representative selection, demonstrating the comprehensive campaign waged daily by the Palestinian Authority. Even if just 1% of the children attempt to fulfill their duty and seek Shahada through suicide terrorism, the ramifications will be cataclysmic. The targets of the future Palestinian terror wave will be Israel, and in all likelihood, other Western democracies as well. This education is an indelible stain on Palestinian society and places the Palestinian Authority among the greatest child abusers in history. <laughs>